Hello everyone and welcome back to the Keep Productive YouTube channel. Today we're going to dive into an application called Mental Walk and it's a journaling application that can be used to uh, use for journaling prompts but also for personal journals and note taking to some extent. Now today uh, we're going to be diving into this application. It isn't available as a standalone application. It's only available through the Setapp subscription but I will link it in the description below. We're a affiliate of Setapp but uh, this is not a sponsored video. Uh, so I'll be giving you my thoughts on this application, how it works, and a little bit more that you need to know. So this application works in three core ways. It has a way to create sort of a blank canvas journaling. So you can do that by going to this right note area. And as you can see, you get a pretty much a plain screen where you can start typing. And what it will do is it will save that as a journal. If I go back here, you can also do something called pick a question, which is commonly called prompting in journaling. And if I press this, I met with a few recent ones uh, that I might have activated. However, I can actually open up a bunch of questions by topic. So for example, I could go to productivity, decisions, life, relationships, career, business, some of the common ones you go to. Let's say I click into productivity, you can see uh, there's about 10 questions here that you might want to ask yourself during the day that might help you get to think outside of the box. This is quite similar to an application called Grid Diary, which I really liked um, in university. And what it did is actually prompted you with questions uh, about how to, you know, going through a bit more sort of uh, clinically about how to sort of assess your day. Um, so you can pick one of the questions. In this case, I might say one thing I'm, I will do differently tomorrow and I can start typing away and as you can see you can remove the question if you want to if you're happy with it you can quit click, click save and as you can see uh, this specific entry has come in uh, that I did earlier today and you can see that uh, I've got just you, you can use bullet points if you want to uh, or just free form text now as you can imagine one of the key things uh, and the sort of third element of this is actually the encryption so they state that they have an encrypted database with this application which means that your data is securely stored for for example if somebody from their team wanted to have a look they can't because it's encrypted in this database which is really beneficial when it comes to journaling and obviously something a really hot topic at the moment now as you can see in this top right hand corner what you do have is something called uh, streaks so if i were to do uh, the, a couple of days in a row I could scrubble to certain days of the month but it will also give me an uh, indication of streaks that I'm progressing in so that's one of the features that you can view on the right hand side on the left hand side you do have the ability to search your notes so in this case I might have said uh, you know uh, if I typed in January, you can see that I'm mentioning January here. And as you can imagine, a good way to just quickly search all of the notes you might have. Maybe you want to search a specific person or a team member that you commonly reference inside of your uh, notes. Uh, I know this is something uh, that a friend does actually uh, to be able to search uh, any memories that he has with a specific friend. So this is actually available through Setup. Uh, let me just show you what that looks like. So if you don't know about Setup, it pretty much is like the Netflix for Mac apps. It's a fairly recent application, but the good news is I did see it had on their store at least a 4.5 out of 5 rating. And actually it did have a pretty good amount of ratings of 900 ratings, uh, which is good news. But this is available through Setup. You can check out the link out in the description below. But quite an interesting application that takes journaling in a very simplistic manner, which I quite like. Thank you very much, folks. If you're new here, please hit subscribe. It'd be great to see you in another video. Cheerio, folks.